Hello everybody, today we're going to put together the Minion's Glove. So to start out with the Minion's Glove, I'm going to drag out the sphere. And then with the sphere, I am going to make it a little bit bigger, hold down shift. And I'm going to make the glove a little bit bigger and then I'm going to uniformly shrink it down so that it looks a little bit more like a glove. I didn't like how my hands turned out in my last Minion, so I'm going to edit a little bit in this one. So the next thing I want to do is uh, make this a little bit narrower. So don't hold down shift this time. Just kind of scoot it down until it's narrower and I'll go to about 20. So I have 35 by 35 by 20. And then I'm going to shrink this down just a little bit too. So now I have it 32 by 35 by 20. So now we have... Uh, Kind of the palm of the hand and then the next thing I want to do is grab the cylinder when I place the cylinder I'm gonna make uh, fingers kind of like I did with the body but I I'm also going to make them a little bit narrower as well so the next thing I need to do is the half sphere and I'm gonna drag this up until it's about 20 the same height as the cylinder so drag this up to about 20 and then I'm going to hold down shift and select both of these and use the line tool to line those up. And after I line those up, I'm going to change them both to the same color. Not that I'm going to keep them that color, just easier to see that way. And then I'm going to group them. So this is going to make up all of the fingers. And then because this is 20, I want to make this probably 16. Uh, width, but I don't want the fingers that big, so I'm going to shrink this down or uniformly shrink it down until it's about 16.5, and then I'm going to make the fingers just a little bit narrower 15 right about there. All right, and now that I have that, we'll see how it looks here. So let me use my align tool and just get them in the general area. So line that up now, just select that click off of it, select the finger and hold down control and just move it up into place. And that looks okay. We can, you guys can edit yours however you want. If you want to make them smaller or bigger, that's up to you. That's up to your artistic style and how you want it to look. So that looks okay. So now I'm going to copy that one and paste another one and then rotate that. So I'm going to do this a couple times. Uh, for the three fingers on the minion. Hold down control. And I'm not worried about where it is right now. I'm going to use the align tool to kind of flatten that image out. Uh, copy that and paste that. Now I'm going to rotate this so that it is about 90 degrees to that. And move it over. Hold down control. Move it down. And like I said, I'm not going to worry about where it is right now. And then I uh, select all of it, click on the Align tool, and line all those up. So where they're lined up with this button here. You don't want to select the other button because then that'll center it. And then check out how it looks. See if I like the way it looks. It looks okay to me. So I'm going to add a torus ring for the base of the glove. Maybe make that torus ring just a little bit wider. So I have the width of the torus ring at 24. And then I want to line everything up again. So I'm going to select everything and use the align tool and just use this button here because I want to line them this way. And that looks okay. Maybe scoot the torus ring over. So click on that and move it over with your arrow keys. Line it up so where it looks right to you. All right, that looks good to me. I'm going to select all of it and group it. And then I am going to change it to black for the glove. I think that's all I have time for in this video, so go ahead and enjoy making that. And then once you're ready to put it on the body, hold down Shift, click on this box, shrink it down, rotate it, copy and paste it. Put some arms on there with the glove and you should have a hand there. Alright, hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you in the next one.